Welcome to Kerry Deep Training Solutions. Myself Mohan and this is Session 10 on Number Systems. In this video, we are going to deal with the tricks to find LCM in less than a minute. Let us enter into model number 1. Model 1 deals with finding the LCM for prime numbers. To find LCM of the prime number, the only thing you should do is to multiply all the numbers in the given series. So here you have 5 examples. So all the 5 example contains only prime numbers. So the first series contains 5 and 7. To find LCM, just multiply these two numbers 5 into 7, you get 35. So 35 is the LCM of 5 and 7. For 17 and 13, the LCM is 221. For 3, 11 and 5, the LCM is 165. For 19, 3 and 5, the LCM is 285. For 7, 2 and 3, the LCM is 42. I hope that you understood the concept, right? If all the numbers in the given series is prime numbers, just multiply it to get the LCM. Now let us enter into model number 2. Model number 2 contains some numbers in series as prime and some numbers in the series as composite. Here, the first step is to check whether the bigger number is the multiple of all other numbers in the given series or not. That is, check whether the greater number is divisible by all other number in the series or not. If it is divisible by if it is divisible by all other numbers, then it is the LCM of the particular series. So here you have 38, right? So this 38 is divisible by 19. So 38 is the LCM of the first series, right? So in first series, 38 is divisible by 19. So here 38 is the LCM. And in second series, you have the greater number as 15. So this greater number 15 is exactly divisible by 5. So this 15 is nothing but the LCM of 5 and 15. In third series, you have 15. So this 15 is divisible by 5, but not by 10. So this 15 is not the LCM of 5, 10 and 15. So to find the LCM, you have to take the next multiple of this greater number. So the next multiple of the greater number is 15 into 2, you get 30. So 30 is the next multiple of 15. Now check whether this 30 is divisible by 5 and 10. Yes, 30 is of course divisible by 5 and 10, right? So this 30 is nothing but the LCM of 5, 10 and 15. Now we are going to follow the same trick for the remaining series. So here the greater number is 12. So this 12 is divisible by 6 but not by 5. So this 12 is not the LCM of 5, 12 and 6. So you have to take the next multiple of the 12. Next multiple of the 12 is 24. So this 24 is divisible by 6 but not by 5. So this 24 is, uh, is also not the LCM. Now the next multiple is 12 into 3, 36. So 36 is also divisible by 6 but not by 5. Now the next multiple is 48. So 48 is also the divisible by 48 is also divisible by 6 but not by 5. So take the next multiple 12 into 5 60. So the 60 is the multiple which is perfectly divisible by 6 and 5. So 60 is nothing but the LCM of 5, 12 and 6. But if you feel these technique are difficult, you have an another you have an another trick. The another trick is take the greater number. So this greater number is divisible by 6 but not by 5. So here the LCM of this 12 and 6 is nothing but 12. Now take the greater number 12 and multiply with the remaining number which is prime. So 12 into 5 you get 60, right? So however you get the same answer. So let me tell, tell, let me tell one more time. So you are taking the greater number and this greater number is perfectly divisible by 6. So here the greater number is LCM of 12 and 6. Now take this LCM value and multiply with the remaining number which should be a prime number. So 12 into 5 you get 60. So the 60 is the LCM of 5, 12 and 6. Now let us solve the fifth question using the same trick. right? So here the greater number is 16. So the 16 is divisible by 8. So LCM of 8 and 16 is 16. To find LCM, multiply with the prime number in the series. 16 into 7, you will get 112. So 112 is the LCM of 8, 7 and 16. I hope that you understood the model too, right? Now let us enter into model number 3. So model number 3 is similar to model number 2 only. So here you have 4 series. 
so solving this is so simple so you are taking the greater number so here the greater number is 6 so this 6 is perfectly divisible by 2 but not by 4 so you are taking the next multiple so the next multiple is 6 into 2 12 now check whether this 12 is divisible by all the numbers in the series or not yes 12 is divisible by 2 4 as well as 6 so here 12 is nothing but the LCM of the first series now take this second series in taking second series you have 20 15 and 45 so here 45 is the greater number so this 45 is divisible by 15 but not by 20 so take the next series next multiple of 45 so 45 into 2 you get 90 so this 90 is divisible by 15 but not by 20 so once again take the next series so the next series is 135 next multiple is 135 so this 135 is also divisible by 15 but not by 20 so take the next multiple so which is 135 plus 45 you get 180 so this 180 is divisible by both 20 15 and 45 so 180 is the LCM of these three numbers right now let us solve this uh, third series at last because you have an another trick let me explain this uh, series using the trick right now let us solve the fourth series so in fourth series the greater number is 120 so this 120 is divisible by 60 but not by 90 right so take the next multiple of this 120 which is 240 120 into 2 240 so 240 is divisible by 60 but not by 90 so take the next multiple of 120 which is 360 120 into 3 360 so this 360 is divisible by 60 90 as well as 120 so 360 is the LCM of these three numbers now you have 36 and 48 right so for 36 and 48 you can take the next next multiple of 48 that means 48 96 in that way you can solve or you have an another shortcut so 36 and 48 right now look the common factor between 36 and 48 that means the common number between 36 and 48 so common number between 36 and 48 is 2 3 4 6 all those numbers are common common numbers but here the highest common number is 12 right so if you take 12 outside 12 into 3 you get 36 and 12 into 4 you get 48 now at inside the bracket you have the co-prime numbers right so co-prime numbers means both the numbers should not have any relationship but if you take 2 and 4 you can't able to call it as co-prime numbers because here you are having the relationship between these two numbers because both the numbers are divisible by 2 right but here 3 and 4 don't have any relationship both the number is divisible divisible only by 1 so these numbers are called as co-prime numbers now multiply these numbers 12 into 3 into 4 you get 144 so 144 is nothing but the LCM of 36 and 48 or you can follow the same trick by taking the next next multiple of the greater number see however this trick will applicable for all the numbers as well as this trick is also applicable for all the models right so taking the next next multiple of the greater number I hope that you understood the concept clearly right so before winding up this channel please subscribe it click the bell button like the video share the video to your friends if you hold any doubt on this topic please pause it on the comment session thank you for watching have a nice day